And Julie's new cookbook will be out soon, but you can get recipes in the meantime on our website, alkalinesisters.com. How's your diet, Storm Williams? My diet's pretty tight. Um, I ate a lot of chicken, a lot of beef, um, a lot of rice for my carbs, for energy, a lot of fish. Um, I ate a lot of food. I'm well fed. Yeah, are you uh, into the farm fresh, like 100 mile diet type stuff where it's all local or? Are you... When I can afford it. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. When I was younger in high school and college, I was a track athlete. Yeah. And uh, now, uh, when my daughter was born five years ago, four years ago, when I got my BCRPA certification, I decided to be um, a bodybuilder. And training at Body Dynamics 24 Hour Fitness, there's a lot of inspiration here to, to do that. So um, here I am, just um, pushing the weight. I love it. Now you've done a little bit of traveling when it comes to your bodybuilding, yeah. and you've met some celebrities too. Yeah, so um, when I travel, I like to go to different gyms. Before I used to go to the bar, but now I go to the gyms, and I, I feel um, that's a better fit for me. So. Um, I met 50 Cent in uh, Gold's Gym in Venice Beach, and uh, he was doing his uh, incline bench press, so I'm like, hey, let me spot you, you know, and uh, we became friends from there. I um, won an SMS audio headset, which he's, um, that's his brand, and um, I showed it to him, and you know, we, we just uh, hit it off from there. And um, it was a great workout, you know. Uh, um, we talked about our passion, and you know, he, obviously he's into music, you know, and um, you know, he, saw my body and said, you know, look, how do I get like this? And we shared, you know, we shared some advice and tips and stuff like that. So it was really good meeting him. He's a really, he's a really good guy. So you're actually bigger than 50 Cent. Yeah, well, he was wearing his sweater, so I couldn't really tell. But I've seen some magazine covers, and I, I think I'll give him a good run for his money. Yeah. People want to know, what can you bench? On a good day, um, a good day, 365. On my best day, 415. That's my PR for my bench. Um, I'm learning bodybuilding is more about squeezing and, um, and negatives. So I'm going more from a power lifter mentality, leaving my ego at the door and really focusing on my reps in my sets. In terms of legs, is it important to do the legs as well? I mean, a lot of people do upper body these days. Or? When I first started, my upper body, my back especially, was my strong point. My legs were the weakest. So um, it takes a while to build up those weak, weak points. So I'm really focusing on my weak points. I train my, weak, my legs at least twice a week. How much water do you drink each day? Um, on a good day, three liters of water. Um, during my competition, it varies. It goes up, it can go up to eight liters of water in one day. Oh my goodness. What are we looking at? Large and in charge. Um, it's like 20 inches, mm. 20 inch biceps. Big man on campus, Storm Williams. Storm has competed on stage in two provincial amateur contests. And just like Jill Foley, he'll be getting ready to place again in the summer of 2016. He also runs his own personal training business called Storm Fit Nation. If you're looking for some tips and tricks on how to beef up, well, Storm looks like he knows a thing or two. Come on, James, 45 on each side, you got this, man. Don't forget to breathe now. Push hard, come on, let's go. While Storm and the lovely Shay push to perfect my pecs, Dan Khan's about to tune in and talk to a local flute player. <laughs> push, push, push. You got this. Yeah, baby. Come on. Yeah. Up, push, push. 